Welcome to Albashi News. I'm Akhila Choni. On to the headlines. UG admission procedures on to its final stage. Department of Physical Education organized book release. Dazzling winning for St. Albert's College and National Judo Championship. NCC cadets of St. Albert's College were selected in IGC IDSSC shooting camp. Various webinars and competitions were conducted on account of Teachers' Day and Bessonary Day celebrations. Webinars were arranged by various departments, stimulating the creative and intellectual development of students. UG admission procedures started on 1st September. The college authorities informed that PG admission procedures would start soon. UG admission procedures to its last stage. College authorities to inform that PG admission procedures will be initiated soon. Admission procedures to 32 different UG programs in its final stage. With sport admission held on 13th September, the allotments were scheduled from 1st to 10th of September. Lots of students got admitted to remaining seats. College authority considering the vacant seats is on the discussion to organize another day for sport admissions. Department of Physical Education organized book release. Honorable Minister Advocate Shri P. Rajiv released two books. The books titled Sports Nutrients and Weight Management, written by Dr. Sajib Jose, Assistant Professor and Head of the Department of Physical Education, Sports Injuries and Rehabilitation by Dr. Titu Charyan, co-authored by Dr. Manchu Unikrishnan, were released by Advocate Shri P. Rajiv, the Honorable Minister of Law, Industries and Coir, in the presence of Reverend Father Anthony Topal, Chairman and Manager of St. Albert's College, College Principal Lieutenant Dr. M.A. Solomon, Vice Principal Dr. Sabu M.C., Dr. Sudhakaran K.M., Syndicate Member of M.C. University. The ceremony was held on 11th of September. The first copies of these two publications were received by Rev. Father Anthony Topal and Lieutenant Dr. M.A. Solomon from the Honorable Minister Advocate Sri P. Rajiv. Dr. Bindu M., Member of Board of Studies of Physical Education, MG University and Head of the Department of Physical Education of Union Christian College, introduced the books. The presence of an erudite gathering added favor to brief but impressive book release ceremony. Second year BWOC Fitness Management student Ms. Alina Aldrin won second place in National Judo Championship held at Gandhigram, Himachal Pradesh. Hearty congratulations to the winner. NCC Army Wing cadets were selected in IGC IDSSC shooting camp held at Calcutt. Department of Journalism organized teaching competition Beat BA Teacher 2021 as a part of celebrating Teachers' Day and Bessonary Day on 5th of September. Candidates were evaluated on the basis of presentation and innovative strategies used in teaching by Assistant Professor Deepthi S. Nair, AJ College of Science and Technology. Ashita Joseph, Second year MCOM student backed the first prize, while Maria Alice Kirtana, second year BA English Triple Main, and Tina Teresa, second year MCOM, secured second and third prizes. But as a consumer, or even if you are an entrepreneur, to make you aware about the basic concepts of GST. Today, we are going to talk about what is GST, components of GST, and advantages of GST at a very basic level. Department of Renewable Energy organized elocution competition as a part of Teachers' Day and Bessonary Day celebration on 8th of September. Theme of elocution competition was My Teacher, Torch Bearer of My Life, which judged by Assistant Professor Devika V, Postgraduate Department of English. Sona Benner from 2nd year BWOC Logistics won first prize. Anup A of 2nd year BWOC Renewable Energy and Jasna Paul of 3rd year BWOC Renewable Energy won the 2nd and 3rd prizes. My dear friends, today I am here to deliver a speech on my teacher, torchbearer of my life. Today's day is a very special day for all of us, where we can pay a hearty tribute to our dear teachers who take untiring effort to build our future. Department of Commerce organized a one-week teacher appreciation program from 5th to 11th of September. Department of Retail Management organized a poetry writing competition on 8th of September celebrating International Literacy Day, a creative event allowing participants to write an open theme judged by Assistant Professor Abana Ayyipin, 
Navin Vidi of Bcom Transition Bank, the first prize by Roshna Jomon of Economics Department, and Nirada Ena from ACC Vidya Nikhilan Public School secured second and third prizes. Department of Logistics Management conducted a coconut recipe competition in association with World Coconut Day. Competition started from 2nd September and entered by 6th of September. Was judged by Sajna Sulaiman Melam Marakatha Swada title winner. The first, second, and third prizes were won by Ashwati K S, Abarna A, and Arati. National Service Scheme of Saint Albert's College conducted a web talk on Venam Oridam in association with Mind Trust. NSS unit in association with Mind Trust conducted a web talk on muscular dystrophy as a part of Venam Oridam. The chief invitees, Mr. Krishna Kumar K K, chairman of Mind Trust, and Mr. Krishna Kumar P S, vice chairman, addressed the students. With their thought-provoking and truly illuminating words. Karena nada bosan gundel, orang orang dewasa um, orang orang itu ram, executive itu semua, orang orang itu ram, orang ada, orang nggak ada, ini semua satu kute itu tak, tuh manusia mau yang mana tu. Department of Renewable Energy conducted a webinar on the identification of optimum location for solar PV installation on 6th of September. Mr. Janish N. Mohanan, Principal Consultant and Partner, Alenso Energy Kochi, was resource person aiming to create an awareness on recent technological trends in solar energy sector and solar panel industry. Solar panel produces maximum power when the solar rays are falling on it. perpendicular in this picture you can see the solar panel over here solar rays are coming and heating it at 90 degrees that is perpendicular to the panel and at this position your panel will produce the maximum energy department of retail management conducted a webinar on the impact of gst in retail industry on 24th august an informative session discussing about the importance and impacts of gst in retail industry With Mr. Amal Paul, professional chartered accountant, invited as resource person. That's all for this week. Thank you.